Welcome to Art. I'm Art Nico. This week we will be focusing on one color. Can you guess what this color is? It's pink! That's right! What are some things that are pink? What about our tongues? <laughs> That's so silly. And did you know you can blow a big pink bubble with pink bubble gum? And pink cotton candy tastes so yummy. You know what also tastes yummy? A strawberry milkshake. Pink flowers smell good. Mm. And pink hearts can be fun to give to your friend. And my favorite animal is also pink. It's a pig! What story do we know about pigs? That's right, the three little pigs. Let's draw a picture of three little pigs today. Come on, let's get started. Okay, let's get started. First, we're going to start with a brown if you have it. We're gonna draw a nice little mud puddle for our three piggies because pigs love to roll in the mud to cool off. It's really cute when they do. Now that we have our mud puddle, if you have a green, go ahead and grab it. And we are gonna add some grass for our pigs. So I'm just drawing short straight lines for my pig's grass. I draw it all the way from the edge of my paper to my mud puddle. Awesome job with your grass. Now it's time to draw our three little pigs piggies. So this is when we're using pink for our pigs and we are drawing three pigs. Okay, we are going to draw one oval for our pig's body. Let's color that in pink. Next, Let's draw our pig's legs. How many legs do pigs have? Pigs have four legs. So we're gonna draw one, two, three, four lines. Now we're gonna draw one squiggly pig tail, one circle head, two triangle ears. Now it's time to add some details. So I'm gonna add one, two circle eyes, one oval nose with one, two lines for our nostrils, how our pig smells. I'm gonna add one, two little triangles. And now it's time for our second pig. I'm gonna make this one a little baby pig. I'm gonna do a little oval, a little circle head. Remember we need four legs. One, two, three, four two triangle ears, one spiral tail, and now it's time to add our details. One, two triangles, one, two circles, one oval nose with two little dashes. And now we're gonna draw our big pig. Big oval. 
my marker's running out, so I'm going to use my other pink. on my big, big oval for my big pig. My circle head. One, two, three, four legs. One spiral tail. One, two triangle ears. And now it's time for our details again. One, two triangles. One, two circle eyes. One oval. Two little dashes for our nose. Awesome. Now we have a big, medium, and small pig. Let's add some details to our sky. Okay, we're gonna add, can you believe it? We're gonna add five clouds. Remember, we draw our clouds with bumps. We're drawing five clouds. One, Two, three, four, five. Let's count again. Let's make sure we have five. One, two, three, four, five clouds. Awesome job. Now, if you want to add some more details, we could add a house for our pig, a sun. Maybe it's raining in our picture. You could add something else to your picture. Now it's time for our artist statement. So grab a pencil or a pen to write with, and we're going to write a sentence. Okay, now we are going to flip our paper over and we're gonna write our artist statement. This is a sentence about our picture. So we're going to write, I, what did you do? You drew how many pigs? three and what animal did you draw that's right pigs pigs i drew three pigs now we have to sign our name my name is art nico what's your name Great work today, friends. I hope you enjoyed creating. You can share your creations with me by email or at Miss Art Nicolette. I'm excited to see what you create. I miss you and I'll see you next week. Adios.